In those days, people used stars to navigate the seas. Ancient constellations like Orion the Hunter were later joined by more modern inventions, like the compass and the telescope. On the Earth below, the only lights for thousands of years were crude torches, campfires, and candles. By the 17th and 18th centuries, oil lamps powered by whale oil illuminated Manhattan. In the early 1800s, gas lighting was introduced. And finally, in the late 19th century, a new form of lighting emerged. Now, the, the sky is just impossibly bright. And so the astronomers have had to flee the population centers and move to the desert and island areas of the world. In the presence of nighttime blood, rich in melatonin, tumor growth was suppressed. But in the presence of blood from patients exposed to light at night, with lower melatonin levels, tumor growth was rapid and fatal. We made sure all the hatchlings we saw made it to the water. But every summer, tens of thousands of turtles, already a threatened species, are lost to disorientation. There was a time when smokestacks showed how affluent your society was. But we look at these now almost with disdain. Lights, our light pollution, will probably fall in the same category, where now we equate the wealth of your society with how many lights you can burn at nighttime. And in the future, I predict, affluent societies, they will still be producing all the necessary light they need for nighttime use, but not so much light that it bleeds off into space and spoils our nighttime sky.